how to archive old emails or old items in Outlook so you can move your old emails to the archive folders in this video today we are going to talk about so guys there is a two method you can you know archive old emails so let's start with the video guys before you start I request you if you like this video hit the like button subscribe my channel and don't forget comments below so as I told you there is a two methods first you can set the auto archive and you can just archive the old items okay auto archive work frequently uh, frequently on time which you have you which you want to set and the uh, the archive only they can archive they only archive the your selected period and auto archive they run recurring okay so first i will explain you auto archive go to the file go to the option come to the advanced tab uh, here you can see the auto archive just go to the archive setting so you can run the auto archive every 16 days or you can minimize or maximize the days you can get the prompt before auto archive if you want you can get the prompt so you can approve it so during the auto archive you can delete the expired item or you can archive or delete old items okay so just archive it show the archive folder in the folder list you can uh, this folder list we show in this your left side folder in uh, very bottom okay so clear out item older than okay it will be clear out the older than 22 months or you can set the year week week or days and you can minimize maximum the month or days you can move the old items to the archive folders so you have to browse the archive folder here okay so you can select your existing archive PhD file or you can say data file or you can create the new one new auto archive file you just rename here file and just click on ok then new archive file will be open ok ok so here I have select this file uh, and create this file and select it you can see the file path and this is my new file which will be create when the auto archive will be, uh, when auto archive runs ok so you can also if you want to delete this item you can permanently delete the, uh, the time you have set clear out the older than 24 months we have said here so older than 24 hours will be permanently deleted if you clear click on this okay you can save the auto archive just click on ok then you can create the move PS, uh, create the new data file uh, or archive file and it will be run every 17 days or you, whatever you have said it will be run like this okay just click on ok so this is for recurring archive or all items and for if you want to set only if you want to just move your old item to the archive or data file or PhD file or you can say archive file you can use this option go to the file select the email ID here if you have more than email ID you have to select the email ID go to the tools and now you have to click on click clean, clean up the old items just click on it from here also you can select the emails or account so I just select this one here you can see there is a two option archive all folder according to their auto archive setting okay if you have set the auto archive you can set the click on this so auto, uh, uh, archive all folder according to the auto archive setting or you can create the auto archive in the difference okay archive this folder and all subfolder so you have to click include item with the do not archive ch checked okay if you have uh, you know make setting uh, for the individual item uh, folder that do not archive this folder and if you want to force this setting to archive this also then you can check mark on it and here you have to check the archive item older than so if you want to archive uh, more than two years items then you have to change the year here so just take january 20th archive item older than okay so here you also you can select the existing archive file or you can create the new archive file here you can change the location if you want two years so select now just click on ok so older than this uh, older than uh, two years the archive file uh, the all email will be archived and it will be show on your this is my archive file name okay new archive older than two years i just click on it so it's will start to archive and 
if I click on the left side let me check you okay okay this is a file or you can go to the file open export go to the open data and find out this file so I just okay this file I just created I just click on okay so you can see it will be open here so this is archive file we have created and it is opened here okay you can see so guys I hope you like this video please subscribe me thank you for watching